recording. Hey guys, how are you doing? And welcome to this thing, which is, uh, if you you might have guessed, it is No Man's Sky. It, you should have been able to read that from the, uh, you know, title of the video and the thumbnail and stuff, but in case you didn't pay attention, this is No Man's Sky. Um, I'm not gonna stop with the Mass Effect playthrough, I'm just gonna, you know, play both of them at the same time, because that's the thing you can do. Oh, hi, that sink. Anyway, I tried to record an episode of this two days ago, but apparently I uh, didn't have my microphone plugged in, so that's a bit of a failure. Anyway, I didn't do that much. I, uh... I repaired the launch thrusters, and I also went to this place, which had a beacon. And I'm gonna go back there today so I can show you, and also because uh, I have this uh, thing now. A, uh, let's see here, it's in my exosuit. This thing, bypass ship, because there was a thing that I could use this on over there. So I'm gonna go back there and use it, and we can see what happens. Um, I can't remember where it was though. It was probably... I mean, it was pretty clear. Like, you could see it pretty easily. So I'm not sure why I can't see it right now. Maybe it was over here. Oh, over there. Yeah, okay. It's over there. So let's go there. I might cut out a bit because uh, it's a bit of a long way to go. But yeah, if I see anything interesting, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna mine this Chrysonite. I'm not sure I need Chrysonite right now in particular, but I'm sure we'll be able to use it for something else in the future. You can never have too many ores. Totally not. Oh hey, what's that? Oh, it's my droid thing or whatever. Great. There's also like butterflies here, they're really cute. Some sort of flying animal. Pretty nice. I saw a big animal too. I'm not sure if it's still here. Oh, and also I befriended this little critter. I can't... I don't know what they're called. I don't know how you find find out their names. Or if you just name them yourself, maybe. I don't know. Oh, there's a big one. Hi. So pretty. Hold on, what? Repair scanner. Can I repair my scanner? Anyway, that's the big one that I saw. I'm gonna take a screenshot of it because it's so cute. Yes. Anyway. Oh, okay, I can. That's interesting. I didn't know that I could uh, repair this, so let's do that, I guess. Oh, local scan. Oh, well, that's convenient. How do we... Oh my god, really? Oh, this is so cool. I haven't played that much. I have played, like, three times until... Hi there. How are you doing? Are you a cute little fellow? Yeah, you're a cutie. Don't run away, I'm not dangerous. Let's take this. Platinum. I think we're gonna use platinum for something. Can't remember exactly what, but uh, it's good for something. Hopefully. Anyway, I'm interested in seeing what these things are. Heridium, right, I think that was the thing that I was looking for. Uh, hold on, actually, I'm gonna just, because I think that, if I'm not wrong, that's what we need. Yeah, Heridium, okay. Well, I'm gonna go get that. It's seven minutes away, though. Maybe I should just go to the base thing first, because I kind of want to check that out. I'm gonna see if we can see anything more with our scan. Well, this is very nifty. Because, I mean, there was a bit of a chore to try to go around and just guess where everything was. Sink is uh, needed for the suit, so that you don't freeze the death. Yeah. We don't want that to happen. I don't think I've actually died yet, so I'd like to keep it that way. I'm not sure if you can die in the traditional sense, but uh, yeah. Let's see if there's anything important down here. One would think that there would be something interesting in caves. 
because, I mean, that's usually the thing. Like, oh, hey, there's a chest over there. Huh. Plutonium is definitely something we need. Give me all of the plutonium. Hopefully we won't get, like, radiation damage. That wouldn't be that nice. Is it still this thing? Is that like the- oh, is, is the big pillar thing her, heridium? Wow. The, oh, no, 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 what? What? Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh, no, no. No, 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 no. That was a nasty thing. That has not happened to me before. I don't trust you. Hmm. Well, it is a- it has a gun symbol on it. I'm not gonna- I'm gonna leave it alone for now. I can see that my shield is red or something, or maybe that's my jetpack. Oh, hi, look! Life support power. No. Uh, can I fix that? I think I can fix that. Uh, life support. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's pick some carbon. Let's fix this thing too. Okay, I need more uh, carbon isotopes. Fascination bead. I have no idea what that is. I am sure it's important for something. Oh, look, there's a big creature down there. It looks like a, a rabbit with a turtle shell on its back. Pretty nifty. I'm not sure how the game, like, generates these creatures. If it's, like, pre-made or if it's just... Made up on the spot, if you know what I mean. What the heck's that thing? Hi there! Are you dangerous? You're really cute. I like you. Hi there! The feeds look a bit weird, but uh, that's fine. Is that another Heridium source, maybe? I don't know. It doesn't really tell you. Anyway, there it was. The healing thing. I guess it is. Well, let's get to the station now. And then I guess we could go to the Heridium spot. So that we can repair our spaceship and so that we can go out into space. Yeah. Gather two armies more Heridium to repair. I think that's all we need. So that's nice. So because my computer loves me, and especially my virus program, it really, really loves me. It had to like, well, I don't know why, but it just was like, oh, hey, do you allow Steam to update yada yada? And then it like took me out to, uh, you know, the home screen, desktop, and for some reason No Man's Sky can't handle that, so it crashed. So that's great. Well, that's just lovely. I have to do everything again. Yes. Great. Not that I did that much, but yeah, a bit frustrating. So yeah, just let me get back to where I was and I'll see you then, I guess. So I saw that I could repair something else. Uh, I think it was here. Yeah, this thing. I'm gonna repair this. Optical enhancement and creature discovery system allows users to tag and identify planetary creatures and to identify distant waypoints and alien constructions. So that seems pretty nice. Let's try it out. Oh, oh, okay. I get it. Neval Ginuk Kumfusu. Yes. Oh, it's. Oh, that's cool. It's, uh. That's really nice. There's only- oh, hi! Oh, this was the uh, one that I met yesterday, or the other day that I recorded. I don't know if it was yesterday. It's an Amkualu It's great. I gave this food, so it loves me. <gasps> is that a- oh my god, is that a small one? That's adorable. Is it? Or is it just- Yes, 
Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a young one. That's adorable, man, babies. What about these ones? Is it too far away? Maybe it is too far away. Oh, here we go. Isis Tirae Severtari. It's in her door. Oh, you're so cute, I... Yeah. You're so pretty. Are you another thing, too? So we have found three species, or what? It says that there are five left, and there's eight on each planet or something. Oh well. That's nice. Uh, I'm gonna add some more stuff to my hazard protection, because... Okay. Great stuff. Anyway, we shouldn't be at that thing soon. Unless my virus program decides to interrupt me again. You are adorable. And there's another little one. Oh, they're so cute. Okay, so here it is. I guess we can use our scanner on it now. This doesn't really give me any information. What if I do this? Anyway, I'm gonna use the thing on this one. Here. Uh, what? Shelter? What does this mean? I don't really wanna... Well, I guess it's like giving me a location. Okay, so if I want to have shelter, I can go over there. Cool. Okay, that's a nifty function. Anyway, there's something over here. I'm not gonna go there. I'm gonna go back to my spaceship and save before something else happens. Is this a wait, waypoint saying when we see it? What does that mean? Is this a waypoint? Oh, nice. Save. That's awesome. I guess I won't have to redo this progress now. Cargo drop. Gra gra. A gra, gra sounds lovely. Oh, well, let's uh, put this. Uh, I guess I could put some of the stuff away. I don't really need platinum. What am I doing? I'm pressing the wrong button. Oh, no, 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 no. X. I'm gonna transfer the iron to this thing. And I'm just holding it too. Gas inhaled by Viking warriors to temporarily increase lung capacity and allow high quality battle screams. Wow. Outlawed by many peace agreements throughout the galaxy, many of which are now broken. Okay. I'm gonna transfer this to the ship too. And this. I hope I'm not like accidentally discarding anything because I don't have room. Nah, I'm looking pretty okay, I guess. Okay, anyway, let's go get uh, the. Oh, hey, that's not a new one. Hi. Let's go get the uh, iridium now. It's seven minutes away, so it's quite a hike, I guess, but it's obviously worth it since we need it, so yeah. I saw something blue and blinking over there, so I'm guessing that's just some 
weird thing that we can uh, take a closer look at. Yeah, it looks like a crashed vehicle of some sort. Hopefully there's no pirates or anything nearby because that would be pretty scary. I don't think I have any weapons yet, so that would be a problem. I guess I could try to use my mining beam on them. Laser them to death. Sounds like a plan. Here we go. Please, no corpses. New technology discovered. Cannon damage Feta. It's Feta, I think it's ugh, pronounced like that. Photon cannons fires at an increased rate. Operates automatically once constructed within user starship's inventory. Gold, Omegon, and Sink. I remember gathering gold last time, but since it crashed for some reason. Or maybe it's in my spaceship inventory. That could be a thing too. I don't know. I wonder if the deposit was in that cave because it looks a bit like it. <sighs> or I just have to pass the Woody Mountain. Oh, hi, what's this? A chest! How lovely. Or storage, I guess. Atlas Pass. Okay, I have no idea what an Atlas Pass or how to get one. Geknip! Okay, what's a Geknip? Edible product much beloved by the Gek. Allows big traders to release delightfully scented packets of gas for a prolonged period of time. Scented gas, okay. Geknip gas packets are considered an art form and the truest representation of the Gek soul. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that because I don't think I have a beak. I am pretty sure we're human, or I don't know, actually, maybe we're an alien, I have no idea. What the heck is this? It looks... knowledge stone? Okay. You have learned the Viking word for visual! Yay, I am learning a new language! Didn't think that was part of this game, but it's not cool, I guess. Those trees look a bit weird, I'm pretty sure they don't. Trees don't really grow like this, with their roots exposed that much. Can I fly? Can I walk? Okay, I can walk. We're apparently very good climbers. I don't think I'd be able to just walk up this uh, cliff. But that's just me. I really like that all of the things are like marked out on your screen. Oh wow, this is a nice valley. I wish you could take better screenshots, but I don't know how to disable the HUD. So I'm just gonna have to... Well, now I just made it even more visible, which is not what I wanted to do. I'm gonna recharge my... Uh, my mining beam, because I kinda need to do that. There's something over there that I'm gonna go get. That thing must be really far away. It's still five minutes away, so... This kind of reminds me of playing Far and Overwatch because you have a jetpack. That you have to, like, wait for it to refill. I like the look of those. Oh, here we go. Or what? No? No? Wasn't there a resource here? Oh yeah, here. Oh, it's more sink. I want to go down there. Oh god, ouch. Don't do that. That was a bit of... A bit too much of a drop. Not a very pleasant landing. Chrysolite. Have I collected any more of this? I have no idea. Looks like I found another mem- what was it called again? Knowledge. Knowledge pillar or something like that. 
Yeah, here we go. A knowledge stone. You have learned a key keyword for detection. Well, how awesome. I'm sure I have a lot of use of that. Journey milestone accomplished. I almost missed that. Missed recording it. I have no idea what that means. I have traveled 5,000 U. I have no idea what a U is, but uh, it sounds impressive, so thank you. Thank you, game. That's very nice. I was just gathering some iron. It looks like the Herodium is on the other side of this mountain. I'm gonna go to the left because it looks like there's a canyon or something. I don't want to climb up this thing. I'm not sure if it's possible because it looks like it's like leaning outwards and I'm pretty sure that's impossible even for me. I'm gonna fall now. I was not that. Can I climb up here? Okay, I'm just gonna go straight up then. Why not? This seems very physically possible. Okay, I think it stopped. No? Okay. Can still do it apparently. Okay, you don't use up the fuel when you climb. That's an interesting idea. You should just do that in real life. When you climb, climb with jetpacks instead of rope. So much easier. No? Why am I recording? Ah, God! Okay, <laughs> I didn't know. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. I, I don't know what happened there. Let's just pretend like that never happened. Guys, I think I got attacked by something. Because I... There wasn't one of those weird plants in the nearby area. And I still got hit by something. So that makes me a bit worried. As in, a lot of worry. We're soon there anyway, so... <laughs> Sounds like something is chasing me. This is scary. I'm not sure if there are any, like, predatory animals. I mean, there should be. But I don't know if they prey on humans or whatever I am. I don't think this space suit or exosuit looks very yummy. Not that I actually know what it looks like. I don't know really what I look like. I just hear my breathing. Oh wow. Look at this place, it's beautiful. Just two minutes left and we're there. Wow, this is a very thin ridge. How am I supposed to survive this jump? Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to uh, jump. There we go. Ow! Almost. Oh god, oh god, what's wrong, what's wrong? There was something that happened there. Maybe it was a stone that fell? Or I have no idea. I just want to get to this iridium now and get back to the ship so I can save because that would be great. I do kind of wonder how big the planets are. They're probably a bit bigger than they were in Spore, hopefully, because those were really, really tiny. You could even see them like the, the ground wasn't flat anywhere, it was just like round. One minute and eleven seconds left. Great. What is that thing, though? Why is it like that? Oh, what's that? I just have to go check this out. Oh, it's one of the under-crashed thing. I guess it's worth checking out. You never know. But I'm really curious what that is, too. Does my scanner tell me that? Nope. Oh! Okay. New technology discovered. Accelerated fire sigma. Photon cannon fires at an increased rate. Weapon fire modification that increases potential of damage, death, and destruction on users' chosen targets. Sounds great. Operates automatically once constructed within user starship's inventory. Oh, aluminum. Nice. Well, didn't I see one of these nearby? My spaceship? <sighs> Oh well, I guess some extra exploring isn't really that bad. My inventory is full. Well, that sucks. Gra gra go away. Well, that's just great. That 
is a big square. We need 99 more. I wonder if we'll be able to get out. Like, if we can get all the way from this. Hopefully. That thing is flying in the air. That is a very thin piece of her iridium. Doesn't look very natural if you ask me. But fine. Can I actually take it? No. Nope. Thank you. I'm gonna take all of this because I don't wanna have to go back this far. Is this extra iridium that I can pick up? Nope. It's just visual effects. Okay, this should be good enough. Now I need to fix my hazard protection. Technology recharge. Six thousand eight hundred seventy five units. Is that what we have? Wow, that's a lot. I think. What? Now we just have to go back to the spaceship. It's gonna be a long journey. But we'll make it, hopefully. Anyway, I guess I'm gonna see when I get back to the spaceship unless something really exciting happens. I think I see another beacon. That should be a beacon or something. It's a red line. Maybe it's just a really weird plant. Or I don't know, maybe an animal. I'm joking. No, that's a beacon. Hmm. Well, I wonder what that might be. Let's run there. Waste our precious stamina. I bet it's just like a, you know, chest. Oh, a bypass ship. Okay, it's one of those scanner things. Oh, hi! Oh my god, I love these so much. They're so adorable. They're so pretty, I love them. Even though their feet are a bit weird, to say the least. But these are, I'm friends with these guys because I fed one of them. Hi! How are you doing? Are you a cute little one? A cute Amkualu? Amkualu. You're a great Amkualu. Yeah, you're, oh my god, you're so pretty. Hi! Yes, you are all my friends. Are you my friend? No, you're my friend. You're my buddy. Do you want to come with me to my spaceship? I can give you more iron, because that's what I fed it. A bit of a... Yeah, hi! Hi! Oh, I can't feed you! Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. See? I don't have any iron? Well, goddammit. I wonder what that thing is, though. I'm pretty sure it's from my ship. But I'm not sure. And we're finally back! Our ship! Yay! That was quite a long run. Whew. I'm so glad to be back home. I'm just gonna repair the ship and then I'm gonna end this episode because it looks like it's pretty long already. Oh well, look at that! The journey has been accomplished. How great! I have traveled some. 7,500 you! Well that's just lovely. I still have no idea how far a U is, but uh, yeah, it's pretty far, probably. Okay, let's repair the ship. Hopefully there's not gonna be pirates or anything, because I have heard that there are pirates. Oh, and I need to save. That's what I need to do, definitely. For some reason it always lags when I sit in my spaceship. Don't know why, but uh, yeah. Uh, I think I'm just gonna exit out of here to be honest because I don't wanna get any problems. I mean, you can't repair it outside too. You don't have to sit in it to repair it, which is a good thing. So I'd like to just get out of here, please. Yes. Goodbye. Thank you. I really hope it's not gonna be this laggy when I travel to other planets.
And this is this orb again. I don't know what it does. I'm gonna look it up later. <laughs> 